The FNAF movie sequel was recently confirmed to be in development after the first one's success, and today I wanted to go over everything we know about the film from the potential plot, new and returning characters, possible dates for trailers, and even some release date predictions for the film coming as early as this year. So as we know, the first FNAF movie released back in October to what can only be described as a massive success, even if the critics didn't want it to be. And immediately after the first film released, we already started to hear rumors and even confirmations about a sequel being in production already with new info on the upcoming cast plot details and even release dates but first let's start with the cast so while right now there aren't too many people confirmed for the film we first know for a fact that william afton played by matthew lillard will return thanks to him confirming in previous interviews he signed a full three movie deal to the fnaf franchise confirming he will return along with the first film's director emma tammy who originally confirmed the movie's production back in november plus perhaps most importantly josh hutcherson who played mike in an interview confirmed he himself will be involved again with the movie's production along with his sister abby played by piper rubio who the actor of hank confirmed will be returning as well which is super exciting but there are also reports of multiple new characters coming in the sequel as well for instance multiple reports suggest currently that the character jeremy fitzgerald the security guard from the fnaf 2 games would be returning and other rumors and reports also state that there are going to be multiple new animatronics coming to the movie as well which could include a number of characters like the withered animatronics toy animatronics or even some other ones from fnaf 2 like the puppet who was already teased in the end credits of the original film with their famous wind-up sound being heard in the background plus outside of confirmations we can also theorize characters like vanessa and garrett mike's younger brother will also return for reasons we talk about in a moment not to mention that while markiplier wasn't in the first movie due to scheduling conflicts in the comment section to one of his videos scott Cawthon has already expressed extreme interest in getting him to appear in the future sequels for the movie but moving on from characters let's talk about the movie's plot so director emma tammy in some interviews about the film have told us that their current plans after recreating fnaf 1 into the first movie is to focus on tying the second one into the second game and so on and so forth however if you aren't familiar with the lore fnaf 2 is actually a prequel to fnaf 1 so how will the movie's plot work well if you watch the original movie at all we know the creators reshaped the first game's lore in a lot of ways to keep it entertaining in a movie form with characters from other games the evil cupcakes and even some super creeps for those who've read the books case in point the movie sequel will likely vary wildly from the actual fnaf 2 lore and probably won't be a prequel but will still keep some similarities like the many new animatronics locations and even the main security guard jeremy fitzgerald who we already mentioned was reported to have a big role in the film somehow likely as the main character or a side character among our already established first film cast and speaking of which another big part of this movie's plot is likely going to be centered around tying up the cliffhangers from the first characters in the first film since if you don't remember outside of william afton spoiler alert dying in the last movie pretty much none of the conflicts in the film were solved vanessa ended the movie in the hospital william as he does will always come back abby is still eager to talk with the ghost children and Mike, the main character, never even found out what happened to his brother Garrett, which was supposed to be the purpose of the entire film. All of which clearly are set up to be solved in the sequel, especially since Scott had already mentioned in years previously that he wanted the movie to be a whole trilogy anyway. So there is already so much potential for the plot, and some rumors even suggest that Scott and the rest of the team during pre-production for the film are actually taking a lot of the fan feedback from the relatively poor reception of the first one, and therefore could be cranking up things like the horror and the suspense for the sequel that were not just lacking but were completely absent from the first movie as a whole uh, however plot aside the next and main topic of this video that i wanted to focus on is the fnaf movie sequels trailers and release dates when can we expect the film to finally release and when can we expect to get some teasers and trailers well as of right now we know for a fact from multiple sources that the film is already in pre-production which means they are as we speak making up the script what type of actors they would want maybe even do doing some casting calls for the new characters, just working on all of the business stuff before filming hopefully in a few months. And using the first movie as a reference for release dates, it started filming in early February of 2023, which lasted about two months, before they finished up and made the final cut for the film for release in October, about nine months later. So as a general benchmark, we can expect the sequel to take a similar time from filming of about eight to nine months as a basic estimate. And this matters a lot because we actually already have 
have an idea for when the movie could start filming as well since as of right now some decently reliable sources who have leaked other things in the past have stated that the film's current planned filming dates are in the summer of this year which makes sense considering pre-production for the film has already started of course but what's super interesting also is that we recently got a brand new entry for the FNAF movie 2 from the article company production weekly an extremely reliable news source for leaking film information that listed the sequel on their subscription service mostly using placeholder descriptions and locations from the first one because of course it's still in pre-production but it also labeled the movie in the top left for spring of 2024 which seems to suggest the movie could actually go into production and filming as early as this spring or at the absolute earliest this March which was also backed up by some other decently reliable leakers who said the same thing as well so it seems like while we have a lot of conflicting dates here and they all could be correct because movie dates change around a lot I'm sure a good general range for when the movie could start filming is around spring to summer of 2024 and considering like we said that the first movie took about eight to nine months from the start of filming to hit theaters we can use this to make a pretty decent guess that the movie will release as late as early to mid 2025 or assuming everything goes absolutely perfectly the film could even be ready as early as late 2024 at least according to these estimates assuming everything comes out at the earliest now do I think that the film will actually somehow release this year to be honest I don't know because while it'd be super cool I also don't want them to rush it and have more scenes that look like this so even if they can I'm definitely willing to wait a little bit extra to have the movie reach a higher quality but while we have a good general idea on when the movie will come out now the next biggest question is when can we expect to start getting some trailers and official announcements well with the first FNAF movie we got our first teaser trailer after multiple other teasers about three months after production for the movie started in May and so I think we can expect a similar pattern here getting new teasers and trailers in about late summer to fall this year assuming everything goes to plan in fact if you didn't know this year happens to be the 10 year anniversary of Five Nights at Freddy's which is obviously going to be a massive celebration with full new games like FNAF Into the Pit already being announced for the anniversary this August but with the FNAF movie sequel likely already being well into production by August I honestly am extremely confident that this is when we could end up getting our first trailer for the film or at the very least some type of teaser in celebration not to also mention that November 11th is also the 10 year anniversary for the second game that the next movie is going to be based on so it's again reasonable to suspect we could get some more news around that time as well again in terms of the exact time this movie will release I'm not exactly sure since Blumhouse likes to release movies around Halloween time and there's no way the film will be done for Halloween of this year unless it started filming like tomorrow so I'd expect it to just release whenever it's finished like we said late 2024 to mid 2025 but I guess we'll see